Good morning. Today is moving day. Dylan and I bought a house. If you haven't seen on my Instagram yet, I've been like so excited. We're both so, so, so excited. So we're moving about 15-ish minutes away, so it's not a far move, but like we bought a house. Holy cow. Um, so I woke up at like 6.30 today because I was like so excited to move and everything. And I thought, today's already gonna be a hectic day, so you know, why don't I just make it more hectic and whip out my camera and vlog a little bit of it. I know today's gonna be like super busy, so I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to vlog, but I thought I could at least do like a little empty house tour and some of the fun moments from our day because I'm sure today is gonna be a lot. Like we slept, like no joke, like 12 hours last night because we were so exhausted from packing, but that's what coffee's for, friends. Let's do it. Here's the situation right now. Hi, Dylan. What's today? It's move out day. Move out day. I feel like we're gonna like watch this when we're older and be like, wow, the first time we moved. Um, here's all of the boxes. I'm sure that's super, you know, entertaining for you guys to see. Nothing on the walls anymore. Cleaning out the fridge. We are kind of in a hurry, so I think I'm gonna go and yeah, move in, move in. Since nobody can creep on us, like in this old apartment, here's what it looked like. We live downstairs. Look at all of this garbage. It's disgusting. <laughs> but yeah, that's it. I'm gonna pack my little memory box. It's like a box of memories I've had for probably two years now or a year. Um, just a bunch of fun like photos and stuff. This is like a very special box. Um, so I'm gonna put this in my car just because it's like, you know, important and stuff. So 10 out of 10 recommend memory boxes. A little dusty, yeah. My last moment in this house ever <laughs> All right, I'm over it. Let's hit it. I'm so excited. I'm also overwhelmed. We're here. Um, I thought we could do a little quick. Oh, what the lighting in here? Wow. I thought I could do a quick little empty house tour before everything is moved in. I have a few minutes. I thought I would just show you guys around. So let's do it. So for a lot of the things in here, we're gonna change like light fixtures and things like that. But for now, I wanted to show you guys a little bit before. It has really good bones to the house. Like we can add a bunch of different things and put our personal touch on everything. But here's uh, one of the first rooms. It's just a big old empty room this is gonna be the guest room so i'll have like a probably a guest bed here and i'll also be doing some content in here so maybe like a big yummy mirror a rug to make it cozy i need a dresser so i gotta figure out where to put that but we have a little walk-in closet which actually this um we're going to expand it we found somebody to do that for us i think and we're gonna like add on to it um because I have a lot of clothes. You know how it goes. Um, we have a garage, which I won't show you that. It's just, you know, whatever. It's gonna be Dylan's like man cave, I think. And we'll park cars there. Um, here's the guest bathroom. Super cute. I gotta figure out a shower curtain to put here, I think, still. Has this little pocket. Pocket. <laughs> what am I talking about? Super cute fixtures, nice little circle mirror, which is really cute. Hi! Is this the key? Cheers. Oh, cheers! Yay! Yay. That was such a moment. I love that. A little echoey in here right now. This is the doorbell. So, this is the doorbell's room. What should the doorbell be named? Pam? Sure. I think she looks like a Pam. So this will just be one of the offices. This is the closet doors. These are all of the lighting closet doors in the house. I think they're really cool and unique. I will also be putting clothes in here most likely, <laughs> but I really wanna be careful about not junking it up too much. Maybe we'll do like our futon thing. 
I don't know, I want it to look really creamy and homey here, so we might get new things, but whatever. Here's the master. There's two of Dylan's closets. Bed will go like here. I guess stores, whatever. Dresser? Yes, okay, dresser. We'll go here. Here's the bathroom, it's super cute. I will definitely be taking some nice baths in this little tub we got. It's like a cool shape. Floors are super cute in here. Here's like the master bathroom. So we have double sinks, which is obviously really nice. Honestly, a lot of storage under here, which is also really nice because you all know I'm like a skincare junkie. So sorry, Dale. Shower, this wall is really cool too. So yeah, it's just super cute in here and it has really nice lighting. Okay, sorry, this is like a quick tour because I think the movers are about to get here. Here's the stunning kitchen and my stunning fiance. All right, bye. It's just super cute. I love all of the light in here. This little um, like back splash wall is really cool. With these little wooden things. Tons of storage in here, which I love. Maybe that'll give me an excuse to like learn how to cook more just because it's so cute. As for the sink, I mean, whatever, a little garbage disposal, moving sink. I'm excited because our old place didn't have one of these and I know it's so basic, but I'm excited, whatever. Fridge, we have a door to outside. This is kind of cool. I mean, I know you guys are gonna be like, wow, Hannah, seriously, you think that's cool? But sue me. This is the microwave. It's like a drawer one, which I thought was kind of fun. Eek. So maybe I'll, you know, invest in some like hot pockets or something. I think we're gonna change these out. I like them, but I think we might change them out to like clear bulb ones just so it feels a little less dark, along with changing the ceiling fan. Anyways, here's the living room. Did you tell them about our coffee machine? Oh yeah, tell them about our coffee machine. So, there's an app and you can download it and you can order like espressos from your bed and stuff. Or you can time it and be like, hey, at 9 a.m. every day, I want to open up clock. It's gonna make your life much easier. Yeah, now we just need something to break to us. <laughs> so here's the living room. The light's like super bright right now, but hopefully you get the idea. It is just so stunning. These doors are all open right now. And in this corner, we're actually gonna like raise this up, I think, and do like a TV situation over here and then make this our seating area plus outside. I think we're gonna get like a big, awesome L couch. If you guys have any suggestions for that, let us know. Oh, oh, is my unpacking a little loud? <laughs> It's still a little loud for you. you know, you're talking so a little loud. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to film something here. <laughs> We're removing this thing, this like wooden panel thing. It would have been great to like put a TV up here, but we just want to be able to see the outdoors. So, Dylan, we are not putting all of the tequila on this one shelf. <laughs> oh gosh. We are probably most excited about this. <gasps> So much room for activities. Look at all this floor space. So much aerobics in here. So many activities. We have to figure out kind of what to do in this area. But just to give you guys an idea, here's like the back situation. It is just so pretty. And once the sun is a little less harsh, like right now it's like 9 a.m. or something. It's actually really nice light in here too all of this space and I'm so excited. I think Dill's gonna demolish these even though I kinda like them and he's gonna get like a kitchen here. Our interior designer, her name is Brooke Spreckman. I will link her down below. She's helping us with all of the decor and everything, but. What's up? What are you thinking for your outdoor oasis, Club Dylan? Okay. Bow, bow, bow. Club Dylan, name and backyard are still under construction. We're taking it out, putting it against the wall. Shout out Woo Kitchen, uh, Woo me, W-W-O-O, they rock. They build outdoor kitchen. Doing it here. Then some sort of seating area to watch football with the boys. Then maybe a long table to eat with the boys. We're actually having Thanksgiving here, so we are like, actually in the comments below, let me know. Do you think we should do like a long skinny table here, a table in this area, or? A table to play beer die on. <laughs> 
No. And that should be good. What are your like dreams for out here though? That is my dream. Deck. Some sort of deck. Put the table on top. So then when you sit down. See this? You have to show them. Bow, bow, bow. The ocean. If it'll zoom in. It's really insane that we have like an actual ocean view. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know what to do with the other grass though. We'll probably make it fake, but. Yeah. Look at that. It's gonna be sick. It's gonna be bro central. No. Yeah, sorry. Okay, well, I guess that's it for the little house tour part. The movers just got here. And honestly, I kind of want to cry because I just kind of feel emotional and like so excited and so grateful and so thankful. Um, and I just wanted to show you guys a little piece of our day. And it might be a little hectic from here on out, but we'll see. I'll try to make it good for you guys. But yeah, see ya. It's our first breakfast in the house. So what'd you get me? Oh, bacon egg bites. These are so delicious, whoever doesn't like these is insane. Okay, quick powwow. What are you, what are you feeling like for moving day today? I'm happy, but I know we have a lot to do. Just what I was saying last night. Waiting until everything's built and we can just like lay down in the bed. That will be, that'll be the moment. But yeah. I'm excited to make this place cozy and like put out all the candles and like get a little settled in here because I feel like we've been a little unsettled for a minute. Yeah. Mm. Okay, we're playing with rugs right now. I'm obsessed with this rug, but y'all, it is way too small. We need one that's like, we need a massive like triple the size. We need to go looking for one like today. Um, yeah, so there's that. So cute, but way too small. So maybe we'll put it like in here. What do you think, Dill? Or should we put it in here? Which one? That rug in the living room? Let's put it in here. For now, okay. Well, I've been unpacking some like glasses and stuff like that. I'm trying to kind of find a home for all of them. I'm not sure if it makes the most sense to do like coffee pot, plates and stuff there, bowls in this little one. Then do I do cups and then like glasses or do I just do like cups and glasses? I don't know. I unpacked this. And it's just so sweet. I got this right when I moved to LA. It was like such a scary move, like honestly, like moving away from home. But it's remember that you once dreamed of where you are now. I hate that it's like so basic, but it's so true. So I was like, oh, it's gonna be the first like little picture that I unpack. So did that in here. The rug did not work in here, but I've been playing with like these chairs. These are Dylan's moms. So they're beautiful, but I. We ordered a little like modern set of two white chairs that I feel like could be kind of fun there. But you know, for today, nothing's permanent, obviously. So was playing with those a little bit. Saw a spider and I killed it, which is very unlike me, but I was like, this is my house, let's go, let's go. So kill a spider. Um, so sorry, Mr. Spider, but I don't really like to deal with those here. Everybody just went to the other house to like pack all of that up and everything. So I'm just hanging back and waiting till they all get back and I'm like unpacking some random stuff. So that's how it's going so far. We have been packing all day. Well, it's only like 5.30, but it's like pitch black outside, but I'm gonna show you guys a little glimpse of the sunset. Can you see it? Oh, so pretty. So pretty. Wow. Here's an update on the room. <laughs> we still have a long way to go. And like I said, we're ordering new furniture and everything. So it's gonna look totally different in here, but you know, we had to throw some things in. 
in here. This rug ended up fitting the best in here size-wise for right now. Um, we'll probably switch it out, but I do like it. It's actually really, really cute. Kitchen's super clean, obviously. And Dylan's mom came and she's helping out. She's amazing. So very excited about that. We got a bed being built. This room had a little bit of progress. I mean, I still think we have a while to go, but it's kind of looking cute. I'm so dead from today, but very rewarding. So, did you hear about the house? How was day as you sit in your new living room? We successfully transferred everything. We have not unpacked, nor do we have the furniture we're actually gonna use. But it's a good, it's a good step. start. It looks a like start. a home, and that feels good. I think a big TV over there with getting rid of that light will look sick. Absolutely. I think yeah. it's going to feel really nice in here. I got oh. 18,000 steps today. He got 18,000 steps. How many I, miles is that? I climbed 101 flights of stairs, 8.45 miles, and burned roughly... 3,300 calories, that's not bad. But I, and my resting heart rate is down to 53, so, I mean, come on. I'm a freak athlete. That's pretty impressive. If moving was a professional sport, I'd be D3. So, does that mean you can donate two meals through Visor, or one? Just one. But you did donate a meal. All right, well, thank you guys so much for tuning in. We are exhausted, I'm gonna have a little glass of wine, and I think we're just going to chill, prop our feet. Um, can't really feel my feet at the moment. So, um, yeah, that's going to be a treat. And make sure to subscribe, like, comment, and stay tuned for more home decor kind of YouTube videos. Bye!